Google Spring Cleaning decided to get rid of the Google URL shortener. Hi, Taylor here at Financial Potion, where video is your financial potion. To never miss out on a video, please make sure you're subscribed to our channel and click on the bell to get notified when a new video is uploaded. Of course, if you want one-to-one -one training, please click above and connect with us on our Patreon page. Google is always cleaning things up, deleting apps on a whim. I'm not sure if they have a dartboard in their office and whatever gets hit gets nixed or what's going on. However, starting on March 30th, they marked the end of the Google URL shortener. I personally loved using the Google URL shortener. Whenever I had a long URL that needed to be shortened, uh, I could get it optimized on YouTube within the description box. It was really nice and easy and had an attractive geo.gl link that would track how many clicks the shortened link received. It was also a free app, which is always nice when free works well. Google reported that all links will still be active. However, you won't be able to make new links or track their clicks. Now, the next best option to use is Bitly. Here, you can also create shortened URLs for free and track them. However, for more customization on the links and a longer view of those analytics, you'll have to pay for an account. So how do you feel about the Google URL shortener being gone and how often do you have to shorten your URLs? Share in the comment box below and until next week, stay engaging.